menopause has a very significant impact on treatment, and treatment has a very significant impact on menopause. Um, again, uh, women with um, breast cancer and gynecologic cancers are the ones that are most affected by this, um, especially women with breast cancer through the combination of the radiation, chemotherapy, and the hormonal medicine that we now use routinely. These women unfortunately go into this menopause that is more severe than natural menopause. Instead of going gradually through the decre decrease in the hormones, these women very frequently start from a high level and then just plummet into, w into the area where they have no hormones at all. So that is very difficult. Um, yet and again, it's another area that we believe is not addressed enough. Um, and even for this population of women that cannot have supplemental hormones, there's a vast number of options that are available, such as herbal medicine, such as medicine that is not hormonal, such as acupuncture and exercise. So what we have been able to do in, in the special program that we have started, uh, the Sexuality, Intimacy and Menopause program, is we provide a very personalized treatment and a very personalized treatment plan. What is appropriate for one patient is absolutely not appropriate for somebody else. So we truly come up with these designer plans for these women, women depending on what they struggle with, depending on their disease and what kind of treatment they are undergoing, and we're able to help them in different ways. But unquestionably, at the end, we are always able to find a way to get them through that, whether it's menopause, whether it's sexuality or intimacy issues.